And this breaking news from overnight, a fire at a West Houston apartment complex. This happened at a complex on Whitting Drive and South Derry Ashford. Brittany Jeffers is there live with the very latest. Brittany. Now, a lot of smoke in the area. We just saw a hot spot flare up in the apartment complex about five minutes ago. Crews are still working to try to make sure that there's not any flare ups out here. You can see the smoke just billowing from the top of this three story apartment complex. Some of the balconies out here charred, uh, several units uh, destroyed. I just got an update from a chief out on the scene with the Houston Fire Department. He says they are, they are unsure of just how many units are impacted, but he he said that there is a partial collapse to the building and because of that he says that they sent in rescue teams to make sure that everyone who lives in the apartment complex is accounted for he said right now there's not any known injuries but again they have rescue teams in there looking to make sure that everyone is okay again this was a two alarm fire and the chief tells me there was a lot of smoke um, a lot of flames when they arrived here now we spoke with a woman who lives here a mother she says she grabbed her young son when she started smelling smoke. She said it smelled a lot like burnt rubber. She started knocking on other residents' doors to try to alert them about the fire. She says that she and her son were able to get out safely, but they lost everything. My clothes, there was TV, his clothes, his shoes, my ID, my social, birth certificate, everything is gone, like everything, my bed everything. I don't have nothing. Just my phone and the clothes on my back. No, I don't even have shoes like <laughs> So again, a two alarm fire, dozens and dozens of uh, firefighters from the Houston Fire Department out here working uh, to not only put this fire out, but right now just trying to make sure that it's contained. Again, there's search and rescue crews trying to make sure that everyone is accounted for. I'm going to keep checking in with the fire department. We'll bring you some updates as soon as we learn more. At this point in time, one of the big questions still, uh, which will likely take some time to determine, is what caused this fire. Reporting live in West Houston, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC, 2 News. All right, Brittany, thank you for that update.